Many people think of bees as a nuisance, but throughout most Washington State correctional facilities, you will find programs devoted to beekeeping. Clallam Bay Correction Center and Cedar Creek Correction Center are just two of the 11 correctional facilities that participate in helping rebuild the bee population. That's important when you consider approximately four-fifths of the world's plants are pollinated by bees, according to the United States Department of Agriculture. Lori Pine leads the team of volunteer expert beekeepers who manage the bee program on McNeil Island. Bees and learning more about them is critically important because we're dependent on them for our food supply. Interested inmates begin their beekeeping journey by attending workshops to learn more about bees. If that piques their interest, then they will study bees in education classes and learn how to maintain a hive. After passing a test, inmates will get hands-on experience by working with multiple hives. Program participants are thankful for this unique opportunity. Where I grew up at, I never would have probably contacted, uh, come in contact with bees or some person that's interested in the schooling that I took. Um, it just probably wouldn't have happened in the city life I grew up in. Beekeeping programs help support the success of individuals by providing them opportunities and embracing change, which are key department values. It helps further the mission of improving public safety by positively changing lives and the commitment to partner with others to transform lives for a better Washington. Both bees and humans benefit from this connection. It's been an amazing journey and it's been so much fun to watch their evolution, both as humans and as beekeepers, because they grow. Every time they come out here, they learn something new. Um, and that's, that's why we're here, that's why we do it.